Hi students, in this video we solve uh, DTFT greater problems using properties of DTFT, right? So, I am going to write problems, if I have to take a problem, let us see, right? The first problem is x of n is equal to a power minus n u of minus n. Okay, so problem number one, x of n is equal to a power minus n u of minus n. I have to find a DTFT. What is DTFT formula? X of e power j omega, right, is equal to summation n goes to minus infinity plus infinity x of n e power minus j omega. So if you substitute x of n value here, it will be very tedious to find the answer. So we have to use properties, right. So if you want to use property, let us see, we compare this with some basic DTFT we know. We know the DTFT of uh, a and u of n. So, if x of n is equal to a power n u of n, we know that it has DTFT x of e power j omega, which is equal to 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega. So, a n u of n has a DTFT, this one means here we have a power n u of minus n. Right, what is the relationship between these two? This is time reverse reversion of this one, right? So n is replaced by minus, here n is replaced by minus, so time reversed, right? So I can apply time reversal property. What is time reversal property? If x of n has a DTFT of um, x of e power g omega, x of minus n as dtft of x of e power minus j omega that is replace omega by minus omega so a n u of n as dtft of 1 by 1 minus a e power j omega means a n a power minus n u of minus n as a dtft of 1 by 1 minus a e power j omega so using time reversal property This we have to write at the exam. So then, right, if x of n a is equal to a n u of n, x of e power j omega is this one. So a power n minus a u of minus n is time reverse relation of this one. So this is the DTFT of this is that, right? So simple problem. What about second problem? A modulus n, right? So this is another simple problem. This problem we have solved in a detailed way in one video I posted already. But here we solve by using properties in the simplest manner. So a n u of n. Right, I am going to use property only. So you see your modulus n, modulus n takes both plus n. It means plus n and minus n. So I can write this one as a n u of n plus a power minus n u of minus n n takes both positive value and negative value, right? So this is what uh, x of n. So what is x of v power j omega? x of v power j omega is DTFT of x of n. So DTFT of x of n is x of v power j omega. Here DTFT of a n u of n is already we know it is 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega. What is DTFT of a power minus a u of minus n? Just now only we solved. The answer is 1 by 1 minus a e power plus j omega. So 1 by 1 minus a e power plus j omega. Fine. Okay. So this must be mod a greater than 1. This must be mod a less than 1. Okay. So what will happen if we simplify what we get is we will get the answer 1 by 1 minus 2a cos omega plus a squared here 1 minus a squared. This is what we got already in the uh, problem of uh, DTFT. What is DTFT of a problem? I posted one video, right? So that is big, uh, that, uh, that, that problem, that, uh, in, that, in that problem I solved in a detailed manner. So, but the property reduces the steps and uh, we get the answer in the most simplest way. Okay. Third problem, what is the third problem? It is n into a power n u uh, of n, right? So, let us see. Mm, n into x of n 
is equal to um, program x of n is equal to n into a power n u of n. This is another simple problem, right? So we know a n u of n as z and so on of solidity free of um, what you call 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega, right? So let us assume this is y of n. If it is y of n, this is y of e power j omega. So n into a n u of n. That's what I have to find. So I can write n into y of n. n into y of n as dtft of j into d by d omega into y of g omega. Right? This is what a time differentiation property. So time differentiation property of dtft. Right? So what I want to find this implies n and dtft. You put dtft. A and u of n is dtft, this one. So n into v of n is a and u of n. a and u of n as a dtft of j into d by d omega. y of equal to omega is 1 by 1 minus a e power j omega. So differentiate this and multiply by j. So when you got j into, right? So if you differentiate, it is minus 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega whole square into uh, minus a e power minus j omega, right? Into minus j. Yeah. So this is what uh, my differentiation. If I differentiate, I get this. So if you simplify, it will become j into j minus 1. This is minus j, so plus 1. So here 1 minus, here 1 minus. So a e power minus j omega divided by 1 minus a e power minus j omega whole square. This is what a dtft of n a power n u of n. Right? So that's what a simple problem. Right? j into minus j is 1. This minus this minus plus so a e power minus j. Okay. What about uh, fourth one? Fourth problem is three by four whole power n, right? So okay, three by four. Um, right. This is also another simple problem. DTFD is very simple to solve. What about this? Uh, x of n is equal to 3 by 4 whole power n u of n minus 4. Right? So, can we use a n given formula? a n given as dtft of 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j. Here a is working, okay. u n is not there, u of n minus 4 is there. So, I want this one should be n minus 4. Then only I can apply time shifting property. So, what I do? I multiply and divide by 3 by 4. So 3 by 4, 4 minus 4. Right? So u of n minus 4. Why? See here we have n minus 4. Here also if you have n minus 4, I can use time shifting property of dtft. X of n minus k. Right? So otherwise uh, I cannot use this will be equal to e power minus j k omega into x of e power j omega. This is a time shifting property. So here n minus 4, here n one is there. So I want everything should be, n should be replaced by n minus 4. Then only I can apply uh, time shifting property. So that's why I add and subtract to 4 minus 4. That means what 4 minus 4 is 0, 3 by 4 0 is uh, 1. So we don't have everything. So you understand why I put 4 minus 4, not 3 minus 3 or 2 minus 2 or 5 minus 5. Right? Because I want n minus 4 here. So now you see 3 by 4. Yeah, everything is 3 by 4. So n minus 4. This minus 4 I bring here. And this 3 by 4, 4 as it is, I keep as it is. U of n minus 4. Fine. So this will be equal to this 3 by 4 is a constant. I, I take it outside this one. Right? Remaining fellow is this one. 3 by 4, n minus 4, u of n minus 4. So that is equal to 
3 by 4 whole power 4 you see everything is shifted by n so i can write what is the thing so this one i have to simplify how i am going to simplify see a n u of n as a transform of sorry dtft of 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega fine so if it is shifted by n minus k a n minus k u of n minus k this will become e power minus j omega k into 1 by a b e power minus j omega right so here instead of k we have 4 everything is shifted by 4 so what will happen a is 3 by 4 so 1 by this one a a is 3 by 4 e power minus j omega right omega that is multiplied by e power minus j omega k is 4 there i have used time shifting property of z so now you see what is the answer if you simplify okay it will be like this so it is 3 by 4 here also e power minus j omega everything is power of 4 e power minus j omega 4 so 3 by 4 whole power 4 e power minus j omega 4 divided by 1 minus 3 by 4 e power minus j omega this is the dtft of 3 by 4 power n u of n minus 4 fine okay next problem is uh, this is also a simple problem what is the thing fifth problem x of n is equal to a power n u of minus n minus 1 right okay so here you see i can write this one as a power n u of minus right n plus 1 right everything is shifted by n plus 1 right so i want here a minus uh, minus n minus 1 right here i have one n only so if you but one n is shifted everywhere it should be shifted by same amount then only i can apply uh, time shifting property of dtft so what i need is uh, minus of n plus 1 i want here so to achieve that why what i'm going to do is i multiply and divide by a so a n a1 into a minus 1 u of minus n minus 1 right so why i put a power 1 and a power minus 1 a power 1 into a power minus 1 1 only so it won't affect our equation so u of minus n minus 1 why i put 1 not 2 or 3 because the shift is by 1 so i want 1 here with respect to n so what i am going to do a power minus i write as 1 by a this one a power n plus 1 fine this is u of minus n minus 1 fine next what i am going to do 1 by a a power i take minus outside minus n minus 1 u of minus n minus 1 Right, this is minus n minus 1 minus this it is plus 1 n plus 1 only so i simplify like this okay so that will be equal to 1 by a here you see it is a n u n formula but shifted by the same amount uh, what do you call minus n minus 1 yes so how can we write a n u n as a uh, transform of uh, 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j omega fine okay so here what we have everything is shifted minus so shifted and time reversed so shift means what a n minus k u of n minus k will have z property that is property
right? How can we write? See, a n u of m as dt of t of 1 by 1 minus a e power minus j of x. Fine? Okay, suppose if t is shifted by n minus k u of n minus k as per uh, time shifting property of uh, dt of t, what we get e power j omega k divided by 1 minus a e power minus j omega. Right? Okay. So now what we have to do e power minus j omega k. Right? e power minus j. Now it is minus of n minus 1. So otherwise it is minus of it is time reversed, right? A power. So what will happen? A of minus n minus k u of uh, right minus n minus k is time reverse I means omega should be replaced by minus omega. So j omega omega should be replaced by minus omega means plus j omega k divided by 1 minus a right e power minus j plus j omega k so it is time shifting property of dtft it is time reversal right if uh, here it is replaced here it is shifted by uh, reversed by minus means you see this omega should be replaced by minus omega that is what time reversal property so minus omega becomes plus omega here also minus omega becomes plus omega fine okay so replace time reversal means replace omega by minus omega time shifting means multiply by e power minus j omega okay so now you see what we have to find dtft of a power minus 1 this is a power minus 1 minus n minus 1 you have minus n minus 1 so 1 by a is that okay 1 by a a power minus 1 u of minus uh, u of uh, minus n okay, sorry. Mm. u of minus n minus 1 right so this part of me a omega a into a power minus 1 minus n minus 1 u of minus n minus 1 that has a dtft of 1 by a you see a power plus 1 is there if it is minus 1 means i have to replace by a power minus if it is a power plus n k we have to put minus so e power j omega k is equal to 1 so j omega is 1 divided by 1 minus a inverse right here a plus here a minus so a inverse what you call e power plus j omega k into 1 k is equal to 1 so this is what our dtft right so the answer is this one so 1 by a e power j omega by 1 minus a inverse e power j omega right so that's it is it easy to understand so dtft of a n u of minus m minus 1 right i hope you understand all the problems if you have any doubt please ask me in the comment section i will be glad thank you